Hey what's up guys, welcome to back to a brand new video on the channel. So I've got 100 k squad builder for you guys today. Oh like today, so I've got this is my second upload for today currently. Um my last team is a one million coin squad builder, so I thought I'd dumb it down a little bit today and, and make it 100 k team. So I should start off playing with Lucas. This is a normal Lucas meant to be in the team, but I don't want to forget to put him in, so this is not playing much Lucas meant to be in the team, it's just I've got him, so I'm putting him in. This is normal Lucas meant to be there. I actually got already got put him off Lucas, then it's all good. But in goal, Kepa. Aber Zibalaga. This guy's good. He's a very, very, if I'm, if I'm honest, average goalkeeper. But he, he stops shots out, and that's exactly what we need in a goalkeeper. He costs about 1k, 1.5k, so 100% worth it. And he, he fits this team perfectly. There's no other keeper you could actually use in this team without it not being on full chem. So if you want it on full chem, you need Kepa. If a Kepa, he's good enough. He's definitely good enough. Right centre back spot, we do have Rudiger, Antonio Rudiger. He is so solid. He, he just he's just big and he's fast. And that's all you need in the centre back. He stops people getting past him. He's exactly what you need in the centre back, especially the price of about two and a half thousand coins. That is exactly what you want for a player in your defence. There's not much to say about this team because it's pretty cheap. They all do what they need to do, it's like they're fast and they're big. It's pretty much what this team's about. Except for one player, it's actually quite small. Right back, Hector Bellerin fast mm, I think six foot five foot nine ish not too big but he's big enough he's extremely fast Premier League, Premier League right back cost about 6,000 coins for this guy or 4k actually I can't remember he's absolutely quality Bellerin is exactly what we need in the right back Premier League maybe um, I think he costs about 4.6k but obviously there are better options like possibly Pereira or Walker obviously but I've, I've, st I've stuck to this budget Bellerin is a very, very good right back, and he's good enough. He'll do the job for you, just as you need him to do. <coughs> Left at the back spot, we do have. By the way, if I'm talking about quiet, it's because it's like two in the morning right now. I'm gonna try and get one more video out before I go off. So, uh, uh, yeah, it's be quite a bad video, I imagine. Just well, commentary wise, anyway. Obviously, I don't want you guys actually watch through the video. I imagine you just skip to the end to see the team. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, less at the back spot, we do have another league. This is a two league hybrid, I think. Inform Alvaro, a card I did not think I'd be using this year. I saw him and thought, oh, wow, with the younger card, um, he gets boosted quite a bit. 70, maybe like 80 pace, 86 defending, 85 physical with um, Anchor. By the way, I use these chemistry styles. I'll pick the exact, I put them on myself. I literally went in and put every chemistry style on these players. Commitment to making these squad builders, you guys. Honestly, these are the best chemistry styles you can use, in my opinion. Maybe Shadow and Bellerin, but. I kind of think I think Anchor's the best um, chem star for a defender, other than players like maybe I've already really high physical and like that's it. They got no pace and obviously you shadow, but Alvaro is a quality centre back for the price of about 15k. I think costing 14 to 50, you're getting exactly what you need. A centre back who will stop players. He's not quite Ramos, he's not Varane, but he's Alvaro and he's good enough. Definitely good enough. For 100k, you're looking for players that just are good enough. His team will get you to division division four, division three-ish. Past then, I can't say much. His team will keep up with bigger teams, but obviously it's not invincible like some of the teams of um, other people have got. So left back, Gaia. Cheap cheap Alba. You're looking for cheap Alba. You got him right here. He's fast. He's alright defending. Not a physical player, but he's fast. And this team, if you notice, they're all pace. It's all pace. All this team. All this, you just need pace. Pace is massive in this game. Well, a lot of life, but <coughs> when it comes to defensive players, pace you need. Varane's a great example. Ramos isn't that fast, but he feels pretty fast. Bellerin, obviously, fast. Any good fast defenders in this game are quality. Now, people say pace doesn't matter. When it comes to defender, it definitely does. You need pace in your defenders. If, you, if someone gets past you, like a, a Lozano or a. Um, God. I mean, even a Lucas playing a month, right? You need someone to fast to catch back, up, someone fast to catch back up to him. So obviously, you got to play the Bellerin and guy to do that for you. <coughs> and less than the mid spot, we do have someone again I haven't used this year until now. Con I packed him on EA Access release date, and I saw him for 10k. Now he's 15k, so a bit of a rip. Got my shadow chemistry style, cause he's fucking like 4k to put a shadow onto him as well, and he is a massive tank. I was chair squeaking, man. I don't stop. So I'm fighting. <laughs> it's gone down for you. Um, obviously he's fast. Now he is anyway. The shadow chemistry style on him. 
He's very physical enough. Didn't need an anchor. So just went straight for pace, straight for defending. Condogbu is massive. He's absolutely insane in game. When I saw him for 10k, I thought surely he's gonna keep going up. He actually like he went to 20k um, extinct. So Condogbu is definitely worth it. You're paying for so little for such a great player. His max price right now is 80k max price. What? Okay, that's maybe a bit higher. I remember it being 10k. Now it's 80k. Jesus. Average and high in Davison Sanchez pretty quick. But, um, Kondogbio is definitely worth the coins you're going to pay. Like 15k for him, just can't get any better than that. It's exactly what you need. Middle centre mid spot. I can't actually. Oh, yeah, I do. I do. We have Fred and Gilfie Sigurdsons in form. And that is an extremely unexpected one. Um, Fred is just Fred. He's just on another level every single time you play with him. He doesn't make a fault. He doesn't make a mistake. He is Kante from last year, literally, with better shooting. Fred is the meta midfielder for Premier League this year, isn't like Kante. Someone that's reasonable price, 30,000 coins. He's fast, he can shoot, he's great at defending, and he's physical as hell. This is the midfielder you need in your team if you're making a Premier League team, unless it's like, well, to be fair, any, any sort of Premier League standard team. If you're playing a 4 2 3 1, right, or 4 3 2 1, you might have De Bruyne, you might have a. God, I'm trying to think of midfield. I don't really use Premier League that much anymore. Um, you have De Bruyne, and you can have like a. Gee, how can I think? Of, I'm just I'm just tired right now. Um, maybe like a Deli Ali, right? That's two attacking midfielders. You need one defensive midfielder, and Fred is that guy. Other than Kante, obviously Kante is 300k. Um, I think Fred will be a perfect replacement for him. Sigurdsson, this guy shooting is unbelievable. His his long shots, his shooting as a whole is just crazy. He can bang one in from absolutely anywhere. You getting a goal from this guy, 100% if you use him. I recommend mainly putting a. I obviously increase his shot and um, dribbling, but if you increase his pace, maybe a little bit, it would help a bit. Um, than just obviously increasing his shooting and dribbling. If if you put a hunter color onto him, it'll be about a 70-ish pace, which ain't too bad. He's a, he's by far the slowest player in the team. Obviously, the rest of the team's pretty quick, so and this is why it's like spicy. Lucas Moore, right, um, right forward, just click onto him here. Um, 84 games played, 26 goals, 32 assists. It may sound like a bad record, but about 50 of those games have been coming on to super sub, and he is the best impact sub I've ever had on FIFA. Like, even like ever, ever FIFA. Um, I'll show my foot chance record in a minute. It's been bad this weekend, but Lucas Moura has made such an impact every time he comes on the substitute. It's unbelievable. He makes the mate he's so fast as a super sub. I just don't get it. I mean, like, obviously you have fast players in this game. You have Mbappe, who, by the way, is amazing on this game at striker. You have players like Vinicius Jr., you have Gilson Martins, but for some reason, Lucas, as a super sub, is the fastest player in the game. I don't know why he's so quick. If you if I show you some of the clips of Lucas when he comes as a super sub, he's like Usain Bolt against Susan Boyle. I'm not even joking, it's mental. Obviously, everyone else is lower on stamina. Lucas is fast. I mean, I bring Gilson Martins on as well, wants to watch, but. Luke Sal does him. I don't get it. He's way, way, way too quick. He's, he's too fast for his own feet at times. A left forward. A player I didn't actually think I was going to use this year. Vinicius Jr. I think that's how you say it. He is a beast with his five star skills, you know. He is not the next Ronaldo, I don't think, but wow, this guy's a beast. For the price you're paying, one, I think maybe 1.8k for him. I bought him with the deadline this time, though. He's a beast. He's so fast. He's five star skills. He's everything. He's like an Mbappe, just not quite Mbappe. He's, he's, Mbappe's his own his own league. He's like the league down from Mbappe. The five star skills, the pace, the shooting's decent. I mean, nothing too special when it comes to shooting, but with the deadline chemistry style, his shooting does get helped a little bit. He got me four goals in six games for me, I think, with a couple of assists. Quality. This is Junior for the price. It's just get him. Even for a super sub, just buy him. But put him in your club somewhere. He's probably ain't gonna leave my club. There's only 2k, so I'll probably keep him there. First striker spot. Wow. Mariano. Well, to be fair, who else are we gonna put there? Woody and Jose is the only option, other option, so or Benzema maybe. Benzema and I agree. Mariano. When before the game came out, I saw his like rating, like leaked rating. I thought this guy looks sick, and he is, you know. He's physical, he's fast, great shooting, everything you need in a striker this year. He is the what you need in a striker, I think he's a bit overlooked to be honest, it only costs about 3.9k. I'm to watch right now, obviously. 
And um, yeah, that's what the team would look anyway. It is absolutely quality. And tell me what you think, guys. Guys, think below. I'll see you in the video, guys. Yeah. And um, what do I say? Oh yeah. Peace.